Good morning, everyone. How are you doing on this beautiful, beautiful Christmas, Christmas Eve? Eve? TQ, it's Christmas Eve. I know time has flown by so quickly. It has. It's been one heck of a year for all of us, you guys, and us included. This is, you know, 2020 can just go on down the road, right? That's right. I'm ready for 2021. But with that being said, we're going to go ahead and finish off 2020 with something brand spanking new for 2021 from the Toro company. So, uh, about seven months ago, we did a Toro Titan giveaway. And uh, could we possibly be doing that again, TQ? I don't know. Could we? We don't know exactly what we're going to do, guys. But let's hop into this video. We hope you all have a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. And we just wanted to say a great big thank you here from the Spencer family. And uh, yeah, don't gain too much weight tomorrow. Merry Christmas, guys. <laughs> To Schleybach engine guys I just picked up the brand new Toro Titan Max let's fire this baby up and see exactly what she can do So how did that look? So we have the brand spanking new 2021 Toro Titan HD Max. This comes with a 26 horsepower Kohler engine, 60 inch iron forged deck. This bad boy is going to be a residential homeowner's dream of a mower. So you know exactly what you're gonna get whenever you purchase a Toro mower of any kind. You're gonna get quality, you're gonna get something well built, you're gonna get something heavy duty. It doesn't matter if it's a residential unit or a commercial unit like we use in our business. 
This thing is super sweet though. Tour went above and beyond, made it look classy, made it look, uh, I guess, aggressive at the same sense. The black and red together, guys, is just popping. I mean, it is a good looking mower from my standpoint. I mean, this is just my opinion, but from my opinion, I'd say it's a great looking mower. They threw some really aggressive looking tires on here. This thing is sharp with the black rim. So let's go ahead and walk up here and kind of give you a tour of where your office will be for the day or for a few hours. Oh. On the left side of the unit sitting down, this is gonna be your brake to release it and lock it into place. That's really smooth, I like that. So if you notice this little lever here, that's gonna give you your seat release that you can go forward and backwards, nice and comfortable. So whenever you're sitting in the seat, you'll notice right off the rip, it forms to your back really well. Kind of just molds around your shoulder blades. And it seems like it's a little bit higher seat to me in the backrest area. It feels like it's coming up into my back shoulder blades. And that feels real good, especially whenever your arms are extended or sitting down onto the armrest here, that's gonna give you really good back support and uh, keep you in an up straight position so that you're not leaning over or hunkering over and causing yourself back pain. You're also gonna have your deck lift here for uh, lowering and raising your deck. So you can just pull your pin out here. This will come off. This is just like a little sticker for whenever you buy it. But you can uh, mow it, you know, whatever you wanna mow at. We typically would mow it three and a half. So you would come on up here, three and a half. Oh, it's got a magnet in it too, okay? So three and a half, come right to there. Boom, drop it in, push in, pull up, drop your deck, push up, automatically locks into place. That's really, really nice. So since this is a carbureted unit, you have your choke here, you have your throttle, you're going to have your blade engagement, your timer, and you're going to have your key that starts it up here. So let's go ahead and fire it up. You're going to want to choke it, pull it all the way up. Go ahead and push it down. Then just simply lift up the blade engage. So doing a quick walk around of this unit, you'll notice you have a little cell phone holder or whatever you want to put in there, a nice little cup holder. You have your gas cap here. You can open that baby up. Nice big wide opening to put gas in. I notice here though, it says no E15 or E85. I don't think I've noticed that before, uh, but that's a really nice little thing to put on there to remind you to use good quality fuel. Walking around the back of the unit, you have your battery housing. Uh, this is the Kohler 7000 series pro 26 horsepower and you guys know with Kohler anytime this stuff is super si simple to uh, maintain got your oil reservoir over here on the side oil filter looks like it's going to be nice and easy to get to oil uh, tube drain so looking at the back of the unit it has a spot here where you can put a hitch on for pulling a little wagon or anything that you need to pull behind it your uh, log splitter anything like that so looking at the ROPS here, you just have a, a Carter key here, a safety key. You'll pull that out, pull this straight through, and you'll be able to raise and lower your ROPS. Your guard is made out of a nice flexible rubber material. It's not that cheap plastic stuff. Big front caster wheels. Something I just noticed, guys, I almost overlooked, is this rubber mat. So Toro threw a nice little rubber mat in here to help keep up on some of your cleanup. You know, you put your muddy boots on here or whatever. You can take that off real quick and just spray it off and throw it right back in here. Let's see if this panel opens up. I don't know if this panel opens up or not. So, uh, yeah, okay, okay. So, yeah, you can lift that panel up, get in there to all of your belts, pulleys, so there you have it guys, a real quick walk around up close look of the Toro Titan HD Max. I do wanna say a great big thank you to Toro for sending that over to us so that we can be a blessing to somebody else. Uh, we do not know exactly what we are going to do with this unit just yet, but we know we are gonna bless somebody, uh, whether that's a friend, family member, uh, you know, somebody here on YouTube, a subscriber. We don't know yet, guys. We have a million different ideas, but we have some time here also. And, you know, we want to do some mowing with this thing, you know, even if it's in the off season. I'm hoping to get this thing onto some grass and be able to mow with it to show you guys it's cut quality because I know as a, a Toro owner of multiple Toros, this thing is going to cut beautiful as all their mowers do. 
So TQ, where were you at for this video? I'm sorry guys, I had a lot of running to do, a lot of last minute things to get for the meal that I'm gonna be prepping. Had to get her hair did. Got, yeah, I got my hair did, <laughs> not the <laughs> nails. <laughs> So let us know what you think about that Toro Titan down in the comments below. I thought it was pretty slick looking. It is a good looking machine. But with that being said, guys, we have to wrap it up. We got a ton of stuff to get done. And I got to edit this video for you. It's Christmas tomorrow, TQ. Yes, Merry Christmas, guys. Absolutely. We hope you all have a very Merry Christmas. And like I said at the beginning of this video, don't gain too much weight. Or no. Go ahead and gain I some will. weight. I will. I probably will. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, guys, we hope you enjoyed the video. As always, keep mowing, keep growing, keep making money, boys. We'll talk to you later. TQ out.